Hello everyone, welcome to the channel. Thanks for tuning in for a new video. Uh, today I'm gonna do a split cup, straight pour, kind of Fiona style. I'm gonna pour from up high, I'm gonna rotate my canvas, and then I think what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna actually spin my canvas to stretch out my paints. Um, I'm using a really uh, cool color, the Purple Flash, in with the split cup, so that's gonna kind of give this kind of a uh, neon glowing effect, I'm hoping, fingers crossed. All right, also don't forget this Saturday, February 11th at 2 p.m., I am going to do, be doing, I am going to be doing my first YouTube auction live. I've never done one of these, so I'm very excited and nervous about it. So if you want to get your hands on some of my art, head on over to my channel this Saturday, 2 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. All right, let's get down on the canvas. Let's start painting. All right, what I've got today, a little 14 by 18 gallery wrap canvas taped and push pinned on the back. Uh, I've got my little Jessica Winterstrom um, spinner. I got from her at the last um, Fluid Art Experience in Dallas, Texas. So real quick, let's talk about the color. So what I'm gonna do, like I said, I'm going to be using my split cup. It's a four chamber cup. It's a 16 ounce cup, but for a 14, eight, 14 by 18 canvas, I only need um, not, not nine, 10 ounces of paint. All right, so the first color I'm using is Festive Red. That's in the Decor Metallics, Dazzling Metallics. I've got the Persian Rose from Amsterdam. Got the Sky Blue Light. Amsterdam. And the last color is the Purple Flash from Color Shift. My paint is mixed with the Gloss Medium from Liquitex, Floetrol, and actually no water is in any of these. So I want my two prominent colors on the outside, so that's going to be my red. And my purple flash is gonna go on the other outside. Around the outside, around the outside. And I got a little more of the purple in there, so let's even this out. And then I'm gonna put the pink next to the red. Can't see. Trying to get the same amount of paint in each chamber. I'm going to put the blue next to the pink and that purple. All right. I'm actually going to pour into some white. This is just some titanium white I had left over from another pour. Now, as I pour slowly, I'm going to turn the canvas.
Turn that upside down, let the paint come out. And let's use what's left here. I'm just going to give this a little spin first. One more. That opened it up a little bit. All right. Let's tilt this off. Just walking the paint back and forth, left and right. Leave this sucker right here. This color flash purple 
in the blue and the red are really doing some cute little things here in the center. Got some really cool wavy lines. I like this. I'm gonna clean up my edges, get my corners, and then I'll bring you guys in. Wow, love this so much. I tell you, having the hand-eye coordination to be able to pour and turn the canvas is something that does not come naturally to me. So that was very hard, but I'm loving the outcome, especially the center. Let me start you up here in the top. All right, we'll see this when it's dry. I'll be right back. All right, here we are with the dried results. Sorry for the loud noise, like you're cutting trees down across the street. But I love how this is kind of glowing. That purple flash and that red really sets it off. So let me bring you in here up close. Okay, that's gonna do it for today. Love the result on this. I'm gonna put two coats of gloss varnish on it, but look how that color flash and that blue are really kind of vibing off of each other. It gives that neon look. I really, really love this a lot. So I'll get some gloss varnish on that and that'll be up for sale. All right, everyone, don't forget, again, Saturday, 2 p.m. this Saturday, February 11th, my live YouTube auction. You can get your hands on some of my paintings. Very excited about it. All right, everyone, thanks for tuning in. I'll see you next time. I'll see you on Saturday. Have a great day. Bye-bye.